Well, another morning, and uh, I'm here at the um, Lam Phong uh, railway station, and I just uh, purchased some tickets to uh, Ayutthaya uh, over here. The trains will be out here, and it's leaving in about 15 minutes. And uh, they say it would take about an hour and a half to to go there, so I bought like a third class <coughs> ticket. <coughs> And um, yeah, that will be uh, an interesting thing. So I need to find number 10, track number 10. And you can see it, you have many trains there now in the morning. All right, so I think I, I see the train here. Passing seven right now here. Eight, nine, and ten. <coughs> Alright, so I'm not sure where where we sit though here. I see some backpackers behind me here. And this is like old school uh, train, very very fun. I really I can't tell. Um, let me see if the ticket and the ticket probably doesn't say anything. I guess. Yeah, I'm clueless. Uh, <clears throat> I don't know. So I have to get back to you in a in a minute here when I figure that out. I mean, it's uh, it's kind of. I'm just guessing at the moment. Anyway, but you get it here, and it's super dark. There are no lights, nothing. This is really a rough train. Very fun. So I will hop in here. I mean here. So th this is probably the location right here. Old school uh, train here. It was dirt cheap. It's like a, a buck or something, a couple of dollars, Tw 20 baht, whatever that is. So I'm sitting down here. Backpackers in action. Speaking uh, French. Looks like the whole train is just full of backpackers. I know, too many French people. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, that's fun. Yeah. So the air conditioning here in the in the train here is basically up in the ceiling. You can see these fans. That's the AC. That's pretty sweet. And you know, if if I move here, I can actually take down the window. I like that. That's cool. See? I kind of ro I broke the train. Okay, <clears throat> but that's good. That that's like the perfect air condition. You take down the window and stick your head out, but be careful because it might chop it off if if it. Hits. Come too close to another train. <laughs> Unbelievable. Super fun. So, my, my conclusion is, if, you, if you're planning to take the train up to the Ayutthaya, Ayutthaya area here, take the lowest class, you have the most fun. If you sit in an air condition, super nice, it's no fun. You need to smell Thailand, right? And this is the way to smell it. A dirty third class train. That's what I call Bangkok. Right? Because this is the Lamphong train station in Bangkok. And it should leave in a few minutes. Yeah. Man, I haven't been on a train in forever, so this will be very exciting. I mean, you take the, the subway and. BTS system here, but it's not the same. This is a train, I mean, a real train.
Here we go. So we say goodbye to the uh, train station here. Yeah. Actually, this station is full of people. Lots of people uh, lying down, sleeping. Lots of business, lots of activities. People are selling food everywhere. You can see here, they have water. They actually take good care of the people uh, traveling here. And uh, I like it. It's, uh, it's an older building. Lots of charm, lots of noise, lots of smell, and uh, it's a very nice place, it's very cool. So it will be an exciting uh, trip. I've seen some uh, people uh, on the internet, they say, well, you know, it's going to take two hours, there will be many stops and things like that. So, well, we'll see. Anyway, leaving, uh, leaving Bangkok. On the other side you have more trains. It's like it used to be back, back in the day, right? Uh, people took the train, I need to be careful here. You can't stick your head out too far, right? So, so right now, look, look at the tracks, yeah. It's like a spider web of uh, tracks. And in the back there, you see the uh, station. Goodbye. So we have been uh, driving for literally uh, a minute and a half and the train stopped. So it would be an exciting day. Uh, I'm not sure what we are waiting for here, but there, there is another train here. I'm not sure if they need to go first or if it's if it's a parked train or if something else is coming in here. Kind of fun. Oh, I see. Yeah, I see. There is another train going out before us. You know, we just have so many tracks here. So I guess they need to share. It's not like the freeway system. Anyway, I'm enjoying every second here. Just sitting back, kicking back here. In my VIP third class seat. Excellent. It's a big difference though. I mean, you pay 20 baht for, uh, for it very good seat here yeah. and if you if you choose to upgrade you pay a lot more but taking you to the same location you're just wasting your money and the good thing here you can actually open the window as you can see I love that stuff yeah. perfect because you connect it to what's outside you know so right now I'm connected to all these trains here and there's a blue train uh, on this side. Yeah. As you can see, it's a blue train here. And there are pur purple trains and burgundy trains and all that. Oh, here's another train. We have some action here. Take a look. It, it, it's the locomotive coming here. <laughs> Maybe they broke. It broke down the first one. So here's the replacement. That train also parked. I guess every train here is stopping. I mean, you go out 60 seconds and you hide on a track and you just wait for your... For your uh, for your turn here. Well, it's fun. I, th I think the trick is to um, to survive a train ride like, like this. What do you need to do? Well, sleep well the night before. Bring water. Bring something to to drink, right? 
that's it. I'm not sure if they're selling. I mean, some guys are passing here, but usually they sell food. You know, every every stop you do, some guy is coming on the train, selling some uh, some food, right? But uh, you you need water because if it gets really warm, I mean, it's going to be a pain, painful uh, ride. So that, that's my only recommendation. Sleep and drink. Okay. Well, I've been uh, traveling now for um, almost two hours, of course. The one and a half hours, they said, uh, did not work. <laughs> the train is stopping all the time. Uh, this is the first time it's actually uh, driving faster. Outside, we have less houses now. And um, what I've seen for the last almost two hours is that they have been, um, or they are working on a new sky train parallel to uh, to these tracks. So I think, you know, in the future, they will. Um, I mean, these trains might might be be gone. So you. you the BTS uh, later on. That's just my guess. Or maybe they keep this forever. I mean, who knows? But from a financial perspective, I don't think they, they keep the, these trains. It's going to be like some super sky train all, all over the place. Probably very, very, very expensive and interesting in the, in the same way, right? Alright, so we are stopping again here or something. Here is a train station. And as you can see, it's, uh, it's getting greener and greener here. Uh, the, the, the more, you know, the farther out we go from, uh, from Bangkok. So pretty much this train is going straight north, following the river, and there is a little dog. You see these stray dogs all over the place, by the way. Alright, so there is a guy in uniform here with the green flag, and that probably means Okay to go. I finally arrived to uh, Ayutthaya, as you can see. Well, it only took two and a half hours. Um, according to the timetable, it should be one and a half hours, but the train stops so many times and, and it's just not moving very fast. But that kind of makes this uh, trip really, really interesting. So, so you have time to uh, suck it in. And I'm actually right here at the station of Ayutthaya, the train station. And you see uh, a few dogs, you see people, people are sitting down. You have uh, street vendors, they are selling, selling stuff. There's a little dog.
and it's a it's a pretty pretty nice place. Well, there is some uh, announcement here. And the station is pretty cool here. Let me show you how it looks like. Yeah, it's a small, uh, old, old-fashioned uh, station here, and uh, it's painted in yellow. And uh, the ceiling is interesting. Look, look at the shape. And these patterns they have, I, I like it. And um, they also put up a little map. Um, there are many historical uh, places to uh, to check out here. I don't know how big it is, really, but uh, I might need to hire a, a tuk-tuk or something. Here's the map. So we will find out in a, in a few seconds here. I'm just hanging out at the station uh, right now, a few minutes, just to suck in the, uh, the air of Ayutthaya. That's, that's important. So I will go one more time to um, to the track before I start moving into um, the old uh, the old capital.